Firstly, I'd like to thank the 12,500 residents who have signed up for the Garden Green Waste Collection. But many people have actually asked questions that actually need to be answered. And I think it's only right to do some short videos to explain exactly where I stand and where the council stand on this issue. In spring, we're introducing a garden waste service, which is optional for all households in the borough. In the first year, the bin will cost £25, and in additional bins will cost £15. The following year, this will increase to £50 for the first bin and £25 for the second bin. I've been asked by many people why we're introducing this cost. It's reasonably simple. Our cost, like everybody else's, has gone up. The cost for this building alone is in the region of an extra million pounds, which is approximately 6% on your council tax. We are only allowed to charge for 3%, therefore the other has to be found elsewhere. I personally did not want to see this council slash any of its services. So, we had to introduce a cost for discretionary service that we have, and this is one of them. I have lived in the borough all my life, and it's certainly not something that I wish to do, but feel we had no other option to do it on this occasion. We appreciate you doing this, but this is not a service that you are required to do. Could you please contact our cleansing service to do this? We are going to be working with community groups for clean-up campaigns throughout the borough. The cost to collect, haul and process garden waste is far more than income generated. Once the new service starts, if you do not wish to have this service, then we are more than happy to come and collect your green waste bin. Many people have asked me regarding whether it increased fly tipping. Well, nine out of 10 top authorities in the country actually charge for this service and they have not had an increase in fly tipping. There's no evidence that this has happened. If it does start to happen in this borough, I can assure you we will educate people, educate, and then we will enforce. This is what the local residents that are doing the service correctly wish us to do. If you do not generate that much green waste, then feel free to actually share with your neighbour. That is something that I intend to do. Remember, it doesn't have to be collected every week if you don't wish it to. What are the alternatives for this? Well, we would try to encourage composting. But if you don't wish to do that, you can always take it down to Barley Lane Recycling Centre or other sites. Once residents have signed up to the service, they will receive a sticker which they can put on their green bin and it's only those bins that have the sticker on that will be collected.